Hi right guys, so welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to show you my PC setup in my backyard. Um, a lot of times you need a PC if you want to run some of the simulation software that is available online for purchase. Some work with the iPad and, you know, I use them and it's not that bad. But I think with the PC, it gives you the advantage of like uh, you get better, better graphics with it and you can also use many other softwares as well so i'm just gonna show you my specs on my pc and show you how i use it in my backyard so stay tuned so what i have in here i have a uh, eight a gigabyte of, of ram i have an intel cpu i have the i just changed it uh, it's an i5 so because the motherboard is not that new it's an old motherboard but it did, um, I could use the i5 Intel. So I'm running that, which is the basic that you can have for um, being able to run any golf simulation software. Now, I have a really nice graphic card right here. This is the 580R uh, Sapphire graphic card. Then I have about, uh, this is a powerful um, power supply unit as well. I don't think you need this huge, uh, you know, you don't need like a very, very good graphic card. I think, you know, with a good, a high-end graphic card you will find it doesn't have to be top of the line to run um, uh, any simulation software in my opinion uh, obviously you can see the difference when you use a better graphics card is uh, much neater much uh, smoother and it's just better um, it runs better when you have a better graphic card another thing to consider is a Wi-Fi adapter I have the adapter here I put it into my PCI uh, slot um, that way you don't have to use the, um, the LAN cable or if you have a LAN cable, then you can hook that up to a Wi-Fi and then use that to connect to your um, to your device. Uh, I'm using the Mevo Plus, so that connects via Wi-Fi. And if I want to get to the internet, uh, it's a little difficult. I would have to have all another antenna, I think, or the LAN cable. So I'm limited to just uh, using um, one Wi-Fi connection right now. But right now, as it is, it runs pretty good with the FS app. Uh, also, I'm running Creative 3D Golf and runs very, very smooth. Um, I can tell you that it probably runs pretty good with any other uh, simulation software. So definitely something to think about uh, if you want to, if you consider to have a simulator at home. Um, this, I think, will be just the, the minimum requirement, especially the CPU. I tried running it on the less than that and it, it runs really slow. So I would suggest having the, uh, the i5 Intel as minimum and then uh, a decent graphic card as well so other than that i think it runs pretty good i'm running 8 giga and i don't see any issues with that i don't think you need 16 giga but uh, depends on what you're looking for but right now i'll show you a few things in my on the 3d creative golf and it runs really smooth okay so this is the 3d creative golf software and now now you see a little bit of lag in there but that's not that's because i'm recording the screen so uh, but you don't see that uh, on the actual software when you when you're using it without recording it and even recording it is still not bad it's um, it's pretty smooth um, I'm playing it off the monitor so I have to look at the monitor but you can also hook it up to a projector um, like I said it's very smooth playing it with a PC rather than an iPad uh, I would say just slightly better um, graphics and even you can even see that with the monitor i can see it better uh, compared to the e6 i can see my numbers better uh, you can see that it's much neater way neater than than the ipad and i haven't tried it on the projector yet because i'm outdoors but um there's something that you can do i think if you want to do a permanent setup i would advise you using a, um, a pc now this is the graphics that you see with the with this pc uh with the recording obviously i'm recording it so is gonna um, put a little more um, stress on the on the PC. Obviously, you don't have to record. Uh, so without recording it, you don't see any lagging at all. So this is what you see on um, on the game option. So if if it, if it's this good on the Creative Golf, then obviously it could work on any other software. So I would I would definitely uh, advise using a PC at least to try it out. All right, guys, so that was it for the video on the PC. Um, if you have a PC, I encourage you to try it, uh, and even a laptop. Um, I've done a few videos with my laptop and my golf simulator, so it does work. It doesn't really require this huge uh, specs on it. Um, depends on the simulator that you're running, on the app that you're running. 
there is the FS app and that one requires a little more because it's recording the video on it but uh other than that any any simulator it's pretty easy to to handle anyways i hope you enjoyed the video guys make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel thanks for watching until next time